Namaste guys, in this video we are going to learn how to make this toggler door mechanism in Solidworks. So let's start. So here I am in the assembly mode. Okay. So first click on the insert components, click on new part, select the front plane. Okay. After that press Ctrl plus 8. Make sure that your no external reference is checked on else you will face a lot of problems later onwards. So go to here, oh, sorry, select corner rectangle. Draw the square shape as per your requirement. So I am making it 400 by 400. Okay. And we are going to make uh, a hole as well. Five by uh, five mm hole. Let's make it zero. Features extrude ten mm. Click OK. Select this face. Click on sketch. And we will create a circle here of diameter 20 mm, 200 mm, and 200 mm from here as well. Extrude up to uh, 20 mm. Okay. Now a question is what should we do next? Okay. So let me tell you that I doesn't uh, basically know any dimension of it. So I saw this video on pin interest. Okay. And after watching that video, I got the idea. Hey, I can make this mechanism. So let's see how to approach this problem. Okay. So what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to create uh one or two more parts and after that we are done and sorry for that that i have done a mistake that uh the hole should not be here it should be somewhere else so i need to modify it so select this click on sketch uh the hole basically actually sh uh, should be need to be here so, so cut this and let's give this more dimension five 10 uh, let's trim the necessary lines press ctrl z for a second uh, trim entities ok and ex click ok and exit the sketch so this is the first part where we create now I have to create uh, another part and after that we are done okay so let's see uh, how to make other part so first exit the assembly component mode uh, after that remove this part so click on here click on new part select the front plane now let's create the other part so go here click on center rectangle draw the rectangle i'm showing uh, it's again 400 by 400 mm Mm, click OK. After that, select this, draw a circle. Um, basically, its slot will be much better. So, click on center point slot. So, its length will be 800. Uh, or 900 will be better because we have to create a, uh, other solutes as well okay so
now let's give some thickness 50 22 or 20 mm is better and the length from here to here is 150 now we are simply going to scale mirror about this line so as you can see it is not correctly at the uh, right place so the reason is that I think that it is not correctly at the distance from here so 900 divided by 2 that is 450 and make it 0 now let's mirror it now it is in correct place click ok uh, now select this face click on sketch let's draw a circle here let's simply extrude it to 5 mm and exit the additional component mode now what we have to do is uh, basically now we have to do mating so let's see how to approach this problem so select this top plane click on mates and select the top plane of the assembly click ok after that what we are going to do is uh, move this here uh, select the top plane click on sketch now I need to draw a point so I draw a point simply here so the distance is 600 mm and 400 mm from here okay and exit the sketch mode after that what we are going to do is select the part click on add components uh, select this face click on sketch so we are going to draw a point exactly at the circle of uh, the uh, circle of this uh, this point will act as a reference and exit the assembly component mode so what we are going to do is select this point mate and select this point. click ok and go to the mechanical mates click on slot select this and this and click ok and what we are going to do is uh, we are going to here click on mirror components so we are going to mirror about top plane and we are going to mirror this part click ok select this face press ctrl plus 8 so if i move this part forward ok as you can see i can't fully rotate it because uh, the distance is quite small here ok it works something like this as you can see okay so this is how the animation look like so now one thing that I have to do is I have to basically and one more thing that you notice that it this one is not correct place as you can see it's uh, 
this one is not correctly orient so we need to make it right mm, so mirroring doesn't work correctly on this one so select this and delete yes so go to the front pane again click on sketch press ctrl plus 8 draw a point here six hundred four hundred click ok after that what we can do is exit the sketch mode uh, press ctrl and right click on mouse drag it and rotate this component okay and go to the mate select this face and this face click ok uh, select this point and this point click ok slot select this one and this one click ok as you can see it is not correctly working So delete this for a second, click on rebuild. Now Select this face, press Ctrl plus 8. Okay, so we got our tour animation. So, one more thing that we can do uh, by simply adding material to it. So, let's see how to add. So, right click, uh, so simply go here organic wood and okay and go to the motion study click on motor select this face uh, click on reverse direction click on distance uh, make it 90 degree click ok Select this face, press Ctrl plus 8, click on calculate. So, this is how it looks like, and you can increase the FPS as per your requirement. In my case, 30 FPS is fine. As you can see, the animation looks quite smooth now. And make sure that you check out our other tutorials as well and our free solve work course uh, link in description. So I hope you learned something from this video. For any kind of doubt and queries, feel free to ask. Uh, thanks for watching and have a great day. Namaste.